Altesse royale, Mesdames, Messieurs, uh, Your Royal Highness, ladies and gentlemen, uh, members of uh, the Architecture and Heritage uh, Foundation, I'm very happy to uh, have you all here for the Global Award for Sustainable Architecture. And I would like to start by paying a tribute to a big name of uh, today's uh, thinking, Bruno Latour. I think uh, we could have his picture up on the screen because the jury of 2022 was uh, dedicated to the relationship between architecture and territory. And in the spring, it gave uh, a pro an award of honor to Bruno Latour, who had accepted it. And he said at the time it was a great pleasure because he was expecting a lot from architecture in order to uh, defend uh, architectural fairness and ecology and uh, in, in all the environment of living beings. And for 20 years, uh, architects have been thinking in a new way and uh, insertion in the world is uh, the result of this new thinking. I, and he said he would come if he was still around, and on the 9th of October, he passed away. He is a big figure in the world of uh, sustainable development, and uh, we are very sorry uh, to have to hold this symposium without him, and therefore a tribute to him. I would like to thank uh, those who worked uh, to set up the Global Awards, uh, Nari Yedin, who invented it, who created it, and uh, who heads uh, the School of Architects, and Marie-Hélène Cantal, who is in cultural development of this city of architecture. And uh, for 15 years, they've uh, um, carried carried this uh, award and made sure that it uh, uh, becomes something well known. And when I became aware of it, I realized that it wasn't uh, sufficiently well known from the French public, whereas in the world, in the rest of the world, actually it was better known. So uh, over the 15 years of this award, I've uh, worked hard uh, so that we can now view an exhibition at the second floor of this building. And I want to thank the Cité teams who've uh, done a lot for this event, and the ASN, our partner, Saint-Gobain, and Gretek, all our partners. Uh, the Global Award, it could have just stayed at the stage of an idea, a beautiful idea, but there have been many different presidents, and uh, thanks to these 15 years of activity, uh, it's become beyond expectation. Uh, something quite powerful. It happened before the environmental talks at the Grenelle and before uh, the uh, COP, uh, various COPs. And it's uh, really come to fruition in 2022. It's a community of 75 architects that exist in the world and uh, who um, done a lot for turning around the north-south uh, relationship uh, because many of them come from Africa and Asia. This community has 
is a community of exchange of ideas all around the world, and the Global Award 22 uh, was on the theme of territories, threats and resources, and something crucial for everybody. Our uh, winners of this year a uh, fine panel, uh, uh, one is a landscape architect, one is a, uh, an architect, one, they each have their specialties, and they, are, um, they stem from their own culture, and at the same time, they uh, have renewed the uh, way of building the social practices, and they've revealed uh, um, a new form of ethics, which applies to the, not only to the social levels, but even worldwide, it applies to the whole globe. Thank you, Catherine Chevillot. Happy birthday, dear. And happy birthday. 15 years. It's quite big, isn't it? Quite tall. And my, my two daughters are even here, and they're almost uh, 30, but they've come uh, to be part of this. And thank you for having been so generous, so patient with me. Uh, it was a dream that came true. It was the project of my life, 15 years that I've uh, been uh, fighting after three years uh, of having sat here in this auditorium and there were only 20, uh, three people and there were more uh, people on the stage than uh, in uh, the uh, audience and we selected people who brought about a break in uh, what was going on in architecture. And uh, with Alexandra Vena, with Rural Studio, with Charisma, with Ral Krishna Doshi and uh, Jonas Herzog, uh, we had quite a mix. And those five uh, winners um, were the beginning. It created a critical mass. It was the beginning of a form of thinking and of writing. And uh, they were the pioneers, and they helped uh, to, to discover more young talents. And uh, this way of thinking uh, was uh, successful. It's, only, it's the only prize in the world, which is not just for one best in the show, but for many, which is for groups. And uh, when you work as an architect, or a landscape architect, or a builder, or an artisan, or an artist, it's not uh, about one person. It's uh, fi 15 years of happiness, of uh, support uh, by the ministry, uh, the ministry of Culture uh, in France. We needed these supports. I was so happy to be invited uh, here, and particularly with the ties I have with this country. And uh, um, thank you as well for the protection given by UNESCO, which gave us a local anchoring and some space and a place geographically and a place in the history. Uh, and I want to thank everyone uh, and underline that it's not just about here, about France and Europe, but there's also ties in the States and in Japan, and we've been working for 15 years. Uh, and it's been so uh, fruitful. And I want to thank as well the uh, jury uh, of uh, the uh, Pritz, Pritz Prize, Pritzker Prize, uh, because uh, I spent six months, uh, they spent six, six months uh, uh, to set up uh, this um, getting together where unknown talents were uh, singled out, and that was uh, from Latin America all over to Japan, uh, this, and uh, we've had some winners who uh, were remarkable personalities, and uh, that, has, uh, that has ties with uh, the last uh, um, 
with also the continent of Africa, a beautiful continent. So, uh, Alexandra Rabina, and uh, Katiana, I, uh, I'm very happy uh, also to be part of these people since I was nominated by the New York Times. And we, there was the rebel Priska, and uh, I hope it goes on like that. I apologize from Ernest Preto, who was going to sign the diplomas with me, uh, which we're going to give to the five winners. He had to stay at uh, UNESCO, but I'll read his message. Diana, due to latest important discussions on the urgent question of the war in Ukraine, at the General Council held today, yesterday and today at the UNESCO headquarters, I let you, founder of the worldwide admired Global Award that creates community between architects, urban planners, landscape designers, artisans, artists and theorists, and not concurrency, present our commonly designed and signed diploma to your laureates today. Please, Jana, continue in your rigorous excellency and your <laughs> generosity. Thank you, Ernesto Ottone. Thank you for your attention. And now it is the moment to celebrate five beautiful new laureates of our community, 75, 75, among the 75 people who uh, are striving to make major changes in the world architecture. So presentation starts with Anupama Kundu. Anupama, up to you. We will, we, yes, we will, we will have the photos later. <laughs> Bravo, Anu. Stay with us, stay with us, stay with us. So it's ladies first today. We always try to have pioneers and young talents, and often, of course, we try to have women. Les femmes dans cette profession sont aussi le profession. Women, women in this profession are also the future of uh, the profession. So we have the laureate from the north. From the north, we have the daughter Mandrup, who is going to be introduced uh, by the princess of Denmark. Merci, Votre Altesse, merci. Thank you very much, Your Highness. Uh, third in this selection, and, uh, not an architect, an artist, a uh, creator, Martin Rauch. Number four, we still have two of this wonderful selection of this year. Turkey, Omer Selçuk, Baz and Yalin Architectural Design. Who hasn't heard about and who hasn't read this wonderful poet of the landscape for France, Gilles Clément? Merci beaucoup. Thank you. Thank you very much. 
And now we are going to start with our symposium, but before I would like to ask all the members of the jury, of the scientific jury who's been faithful and true to me for 15 years uh, to come here, that we have the laureates here who are already laureates who've been with us for a long time now. It's always like that, you know, we have some laureates who come and visit and, and uh, be with us and of course the mecenas of the Global Award. Please, could you come to the uh, rostrum and then uh, we'll have a picture.